Hi, I'm Honda Pro Jason. Welcome to the Honda Pro Show. Watched by over 3.8 million people. 3.8 million people. Man, that's awesome. And kept alive because you subscribe. This week, I have an outstanding show. So let's get into it. Welcome to this week's edition of the Honda Pro Show. I'm Honda Pro Jason, and with me as always is my cameraman, Matt. Hello, everyone. Hey, Matt. So I just got back from the SEMA show on Las Vegas, and the show was exceptional. A couple of the highlights. I got to see and sit in most of the project fits. Those are the six fits that Honda gave six builders to build, and then we got to vote on which one we wanted and which one we thought was the best. Well, Tijin Edition won that build. If you saw the car, you'd know why. All the fits were exceptional. I mean, they did some things that I never thought you could do to a fit. Over 400 horsepower BC got out of his fit, which is pretty insane. So there were the project fits. There were NSXs and NSXs and NSXs, S2000s. There were every car that you've ever seen in almost every magazine was displayed at the SEMA show. Now, I did two videos. I did an inside video and an outside video. Check them out. And if that doesn't make you want to go visit the SEMA show, nothing will. I want to say thank you to all the fans. A big thanks to all the, the vendors that came out. You guys are awesome. And without the vendors, well, I wouldn't have a show. I wouldn't have Project Orange. And we wouldn't really have a whole lot of fun. So thanks to all the vendors. And now it's time to start the show. And we're going to start the show by wishing all of you a very happy Honda days. It's that time again. Honda's end of the year blowout. This year, they're doing it old school. Instead of having someone like Michael Bolden sing a song or a few songs, what they're doing is they, they hired uh, Skeletor and He-Man, Strawberry Shortcake, Little People if you remember, Jem and G.I. Joe, and they had the figurines doing these really hilarious videos showing off the Accord the CRV, the Civic, and talking about the backup camera and stuff like that. The basic idea behind this is one big push, one big sales promotion for Honda at the end of the year. It gives them some more cars to sell and gives you some better deals. What would you say if I told you Honda was investing $100 million into a plant up in Canada? Well, they're really investing $8 157 million dollars, almost one billion dollars into a plant in Canada. For what? For the new Civic. The 10th generation Civic, Honda wants the Canadian plant to be the lead plant for the whole world. This will be a first, and this is going to be awesome. I can't imagine what you do with a billion dollars. Well, spy shots are coming out for the 10th generation Civic, and this is going to be interesting because the 10th generation Civic might be coming to us a little bit early. Normally, Honda does a five-year cycle. But if this 10th generation Civic, if we're seeing spy shots now, that means this car might be ready for 2016, which means a four-year cycle, which means the new car, new body, and from what the rumors are, maybe a Type R. We are now in the Guinness Book of World Records, thanks to the Honda Amaze in India. We are in the Guinness Book of World Records for the longest journey, almost 15,000 miles, over 400 towns, over a 55-day period. Now, what does the longest journey mean? We're not really sure, but we're in the Guinness Book of World Records, so it must mean something. Now, the Honda Amaze is also the fastest selling Honda in the country of India ever. So I've said it before, I'll say it again. The Honda Amaze is really amazing. <laughs> A Honda Pro Jason side note. Spy shots are showing up everywhere from what looks like an Acura minivan. I'm not sure if Honda's trying to fool us with the new Odyssey pictures or if they're really developing the first upscale minivan. It's fun fact time. Honda holds a record for the fastest speed in an F1 car, 248 miles an hour. 
And that's your fun fact of the week. What a great week in Honda news. As promised, when I went out to the SEMA show, I was able to talk to some of the <coughs> Honda executives, and we have some, well, let's just call them surprises in store. I got a little bit of information, and I also got some Honda goodies. So if you guys want to win one of these air freshener, vent air fresheners for the car, this is the same freshener that I showed in Kenny Vince's car, and he said the air freshener was delicious. So if you guys want to win one of these, all you have to do is tell me from your childhood, what was your favorite childhood toy? Leave your creative comments below. As always, I'm the Honda Pro, and now you're in the know.